Hi, Beverly Monocle here. I hope you're having a great day. I just came across a free tool that I wanted to share with you guys in case you had never heard of it. It's called freeconferencecalling.com. If you go to that webpage, freeconferencecalling.com, you can sign up for your free account. And that's the first thing you need to do. If you've ever been on a conference call before, then you know that they're really useful when you're wanting to get your team or your tribe together to talk. And this one will hold up to 500 callers and it's free. So go to freeconferencecalling.com and first thing you need to do is sign up for your free conference number. They will send you an email with your host code and with your six digit code and then you're set and ready to start. But let's look at what free conference calls call.com provides for us. It is just great. Like I said, up to 500 callers per any conference call. That's amazing. I may not have 500 yet, but I will soon, and now I can make that call for free. If I want to talk for six hours, which some of my friends may tell you I can do that, I can do it for as long as six hours if I wanted to. Doubt that'll happen, though. And you never need a reservation. It's available 24-7. So when you have team members all over the world, they can access it. From beginners to professionals, it's really easy. There's three easy steps. Know the time of your call. Let everybody else know about it. Call your conference dial-in. Then enter your conference codes, your six-digit conference code and your four-digit host code. And voila, you have a free conference call. And it's easy to use. It's reliable, secure service with clear audio quality. And they have conference call security, which we'll go over now as we go into the features. Great! Free! Did I mention this is free? <laughs> now look at the features they have. When you do your call, at the same time, you will pull up this website and you will log in with your six digit code and your host code. And you'll have a screen show up. And these are all the things that you can do on your screen. You can, as the host, you can mute and unmute the conference, lock and unlock the conference, continue the call without the host. If you need to leave but others want to keep talking, you can make that happen for them. You can self mute yourself conference recording on or off. You can either choose recorded or not and it's free even when you record. You can require everybody to announce their name, uh, attendee roll call, attendee total count, and new attendee tone on or off. And if you've ever been on conference call, I'm sure you've heard those little beeps that everybody as they're signing in. It can become annoying so when you get ready to record, turn that off so you won't have it in your recording. The attendees can self-mute themselves, and if they have a question, they can raise their hand and a little question mark comes up by their name and you know there's a question. And then when you have a guest speaker, they have an access code that they can use. Now let's look at what you can do when you recall, when you record, excuse me. You can create a podcast, you can download and archive your recordings, you can publish it to a website. Maybe you're making a squeeze page and you want to give away a free recording of an interview you did with somebody really important, this is a way to do it for free. And then you can also go to freeconferencecalling.com and access the recordings directly from there. And I'm going to blow this up so you can see it. When you're behind in your little back office, you can always edit the names of every call put so you'll know what the call is about, adjust the volume when you're listening to it, you can download it, you can create a podcast. This is your embed code, so you can put it on those squeeze pages or your blog. You can mark it private or public, or you can just delete it if you don't need it anymore. Then, when you are on your call, and I told you you need to sign in, this is what comes up when you're on the call. This is what comes up on your like little back office. Every person who's on the call's name, you have to, well, the phone number shows up, then you ask them who it is and you put their name there. That's something you have to do the first time they call, but every time they call again, it automatically shows up their name. You can mute people. If they have a question, this is what shows up by their name, so you know to unmute them so they can ask their question. And maybe you've got someone on there that's being obnoxious and just, they aren't being helpful at all. You can actually give them the boot by Xing them off and they're out of the call. 
you know, you can lock the call, uh, lock the conference call, so once the, all the people that are in there that you want, you can lock it so nobody else can get in. There's all kinds of features, and I think they're absolutely amazing, especially since this is free. They have great tutorials that you can access once you sign up, and I'm telling you, if you've ever considered doing a conference call, even if you've had five people to 500 people, I highly recommend you go to freeconferencecalling.com today, sign up for your free account, and get started using your free conference call. If this was helpful to you, I hope that you will leave comments below. I hope you'll share it with all of your friends, tweet it, put it on your Facebook page, because the more people that know about this, the better for everybody because it's free. I always like to find free things and pass it along to people that I've met here online. So you have a wonderful day, and I will see you again very soon. Bye-bye.